let me say this and this is really going to make sense. Back when I was in sin, I would lift weights and it was really fun for me. I believe at first I was serving God, but <laughs> like when I started lifting weights again, I went right back into sin <laughs> at that time period. And I would injure myself every year around the same time period, every year crazy my lord let me get to my point when i would first lift weights perhaps the first two or three weeks i was really really sore i was crazy sore but i worked through it then after a while perhaps a month i stopped getting sore as much or like that now perhaps when i would add more weight to my routine i may feel a bit sore afterward but never as sore as i was in the beginning some people say that they are having a very hard time in stopping their sin. You have to get used to resisting demons more. The more you resist demons, the stronger you are going to become. How can you expect to be as strong as a person that has been resisting demons for five years and you have not been doing it for two weeks. What some people do is resist demons for a week, then stop. Resist demons for a day, then stop. Resist demons for one month, then stop. Resist demons for about five months, then stop. When you stop going back to sin, when you stop, then go back to sin, you are losing your gains. When I would injure myself every year in lifting weights, I had to stop lifting because <laughs> I was in so much pain so much agony <laughs> that third year or fourth year when i had to stop for about five or six months my lord when i came back i was so weak i was so weak i was angry all those years of placing time going to the gym so much about four to five times a week, about an hour or two each day, uh, perhaps an hour, then on Friday, about two hours, I think. Placing so much time and working out, then having to miss like six months or so, then going back to the gym and finding out I lost all my gains, okay. When you resist demons for a week, then stop. Resist for about five months, then stop. You are going, you are losing your gains. You have to go all the way back to zero, zero, pretty much. The more you resist demons, the better you are going to be at it. Of course, it is going to be hard at first. Why? Because you have not been doing it for long. When I started to lift weights at first, I was not good at it. I was really sore. 
I was in so much pain. <laughs> My Lord. But after a while, I got better at it. It became much easier. So the more you resist demons, the easier it is going to become to you. The point that I am at now in serving God, it would be super duper foolish for me to fall back into sin after all the hard work I have put in with God. I believe if I was to fall back into sin, I would probably lose my level or whatever you call it in what I have in God now. Let me say this, about six years ago, I forget, I don't know exactly the time period, but at that point, I was serving God for about six months. Give me a second, please. I was serving God for about six months. And I did not know as much as I know now. You know, I was more of a weak, silly Christian. <laughs> So I gave into sin because I was weak. I did not know the authority that we have as Christians. Like, and I went to church much more back then too. You know, I did not really research as much as I do now, not even near as much. So I easily fell back into sin. And when I came back to God, I noticed that my relationship with God was not the same. Like, at that point of time, I could not feel the presence of God as easy. Like, it is hard to explain it in words, but everything felt different. It is like, I lost something. And then quickly after, <laughs> I pretty much just gave in into sin. My Lord. So my point is, you have to constantly resist Yes, it is going to be difficult at first, yes, but the more you do it, the better you are going to become at it. You can't expect to be proficient at something when you first, I guess you can say you first try it, but the more you keep at it, the more time you put in it, the stronger you are going to become in it. Believe me. Now, in some cases, a person may be able to serve God really quickly and everything is okay. But that is not the case for everyone, especially myself. It was so difficult for me to get to where I am now. But... I had to constantly keep at it because when you give up, once you decide to come back, you have to start over to zero again. And I can be wrong about that, but at least that is how it felt for me. Like I had to continue going back to zero each time when I would give in to sin. So, constantly, persistently resist demons. It is going to pay off. I am trying to tell you. I don't know if I said this already, but I believe 
I was getting injured every year in lifting weights because I believe, I can't be wrong about this, but I believe that God was allowing it to happen because I believe I was getting prideful and arrogant and I believe I was going right back to my old ways. <laughs> Which I was. <laughs> Much more, I guess. So I pray that this makes sense. Make a practice in resisting demons. This is the only way. Make a practice in it. The more you resist, the stronger you are going to become at it. You can't just try for two hours and fall into sin and say, well, I guess this isn't for me. <laughs> no, you have to fight for it. I pray that this makes sense. God bless you.